Hey, what's up, everybody? It is now 8.24 p.m. 24 seconds. It's not 25 seconds. 26 seconds. 27, 28, 29, 30. Anyways, it is now Mandel, as you can see right there. Oh, no. Oh, no. From Waddle. Oh, Waddle. Anyways. Um, there's a, there's a star, there's a reset button, there's a mode, there's a light. As you can see behind me, there is a bone crushers. Two bone crushers, uh, that's four bone crushers. Two bone crushers, okay, so two, there we go, hey, there we go. Anyways, let's show me, let's show me, let's show me, show me, okay. Now, so that's strength, nine, intelligence, five, speed, five, nine, ten, nine, six, courage, eight, five, seven, nine, nine, skill, five. There's some of the bone crushers, zero mode, and bone crushers, robot mode. I will do him to robot mode, and I will do him to vehicle mode. Capiche? Okay. Now, his articulation in this mode, his arm can swivel like that, it can go like that, and it's got that action going on. It can bend right there, and twist right there, and then, yeah, it's just so types of weirdness. Now, to transform this puppy. Oh, wait a second. Rolls. Okay. Not that well, but anyways. To transform this puppy, what you want to do is take this arm and then bring it like that to the front. To the very center of the truck. NPC C, whatever. MPCV mode. Anyways. You take the front wheels and then split them apart like they're like cannons. Anyways. Uh, you want to take the toe parts and then split them apart like that. Take, just for the forward, take the front of the truck and then there's the front. That's the front, there's the back. Okay. Okay, then you want to go like that. And then, just. <laughs> just. And once you're ready, you want to flip over to his hand like that. And I close that panel back up to not show any disturbing parts of the robot. Like that. And there is bone crusher it is on my mound. Now for articulation, that this arm can go like that. And this can still split. Then you can put the blades. Out the blood like that to make him look more deadlier, which he isn't. Anyways, now oh, stand up, you bastard. Stand up. Stand up. Okay, so now he has one question for articulation on his head. Actually, right now that's it. There it is. I don't know what with that dude. You know it's gonna be horrible. So what you wanna do is set this dude aside and why the heck is he turning that way? What's more interesting, me or that? Turn around. There you go, that's better. Anyway, straighten out his legs and just leave him like that. He will be a one tough puppy to kill. No wonder Optimus had such a hard time with this, with this bastard. That was a cool scene when Optimus <coughs> off with his head. Okay, there we go. There we go. You yeah, stand up, stand up, you bastard. Stand up, you don't understand English. Okay. Let's move it out of town. If he finds him somewhere. I just remember what happened. I don't know. Take this out of here. Frantic connection on his head. 
can go all the way around. You can look up, can look down like that too. You can look up like that, and then I can actually have him. Because that can go like that, and all this crazy nonsense. His arm can go all the way around. Like that. Go like that. The arm can go like that. Yeah, I can go like that. The arm in his hand. If you put the panel, his arm extends into a longer arm, but I see no point in that. Um, I'm sure his head. No, what's the articulation on his head? Like, his, his, his legs go forward, go back, go up in at the knee, turn at the part of the leg. Yes! Yes! Sorry about that. <laughs> okay, um, his foot can go in like that. And then out like that. That's crazy. But there's that. And, uh, uh that's it pretty much it. Now to transform. Jungle Ball Kusha. You want to, um, put his arms up to that. My butt hurts. And then fold it in his hand. And then put that around that. Uh -huh. Now, like this looks cool. It looks like giant guns. As you can see, this makes a gun shape. Like, Die, you son of a gun! Yes, guns. What the fudge? What the fudge? Anyways, you can go like that if you want. Anyways, you transform him. You want to. Try now, it's foot. It's foot. I'm gonna turn the leg, turn the leg, like that. It's kind of hard. I'm in a very uncomfortable position, people. That's why I'm gonna kind of rush. But then I'm gonna jump like that, foot on this hill, like that. Then I'm gonna brrrr, okay, I'm gonna bring this down, that crash piece. Then I'm bring his arms up. And then um, plug them together. And then plug the two. Back into its slot. Until it get back into its slot. I love that gun, you bastard. A little my neck hurts, I don't know why. Then it's. Ah, yeah. Oh, that was tough. No. Not on. So, like, the arm. It fell off. This bone crusher. I shouldn't have some of my land of steward hands. You wanna tell for that other thing? Oh. Eh, eh. Like that. Thanks. Like that. And so if it likes them, so if it likes them. If it doesn't, oh well. If it, oh shit, wrong well. Duh. Uh. Yes, I burped and I went out sick. Excuse me. Anyways, there you go. Bone Crusher and Jungle Bone Crusher. I wish I wouldn't waste money in this guy. Well, well. Jungle Bone Crusher is all spark powered, just like Optimus Prime. My well, first strike, Optimus Prime. As you can see, yes, they now spark with all its positive blue energy, lightning like energy flowing from it. Now, since I have a lot of time, I can read the story to them. Random singing. Anyways, Bone Crusher hits everything. And when Bone Crusher hits, it destroys. So it hurts this planet and all of its inhabitants. So it hurts the Autobots for getting it as well. So it even hits Megatron and the other Decepticons. The only reason he stays with them is because Megatron scares him. Bone Crusher leaves. For the leaves for the devil when he kills the only one left, standing atop a pile of smoking rubber and shattered robots. Then Jungle Bone Crusher barely fun well, jungle <coughs> barely functional after his battle with Optimus Prime. Bone Crusher crawled away from the season of his defeat and hid, affecting what the repairs he could on his own. He also removed his locator beacon and uh, communications hardware, cutting himself off entirely from the other surviving dis Decepticons. Feeling south farther and farther, he eventually found himself deep in the jungles of South America, hidden in the most remote area on Earth. So he was free to 
indulge his rage on the right first without interruption. So, he hates everything and he will kill you. <laughs> Otherwise, that's my review for Transformers. Bone Crusher and Jungle Bone Crusher was my favorite. Good all the battle. And be sure to watch my bad version of this. <laughs>